NYPD is calling the bust a citywide crime operation. Police raided a house overnight in the Bronx and arrested three suspects who they say are behind a string of pickpockets. And police do tell us that all three are migrants and the NYPD is looking to make more arrests. Eyewitnesses reported Stefan Kim live in the Allerton section of the Bronx with more. Stefan. Well, David and Lauren, police officials call it the largest robbery spree that has been plaguing the city. For months, thieves on scooters have been snatching phones and pocketbooks out of women's hands. Overnight, police raided the suspected safe house behind me. They say the suspects are migrants from Venezuela. Take a look at this video released by the NYPD. Thieves on scooters snatching purses, pocketbooks, and phones out of women's hands all over the city. Finally, cops say they've caught the suspects. Uh, great job. Police say they executed a search warrant and arrested three migrants in the Bronx overnight at 2970 Bronx Park East, a suspected safe house. This department, this agency is not going to tolerate that. We will find you. Anyone that commits any act of harm against one of our New Yorkers, we're going to find you, we're going to arrest you, we're going to bring you to justice. The suspects are expected to be charged with multiple robberies and grand larcenies. The men were linked to a pattern of at least 62 incidents of snatching. Detectives think the suspects then used those stolen phones to access the Apple Pay feature to make other purchases. There are 172,000 migrants asylum seekers who are here. Overwhelmingly, many are here just want the same thing all of our families want. For those who think they're going to come to our country, break our laws, assault our cops. That was not only assault on an individual, that was assault on our system of public safety. Their behavior is horrible. They need to deport them. Maria Ortiz says she's been living on the block for nine years. Lately, she says, mopeds are everywhere and crime has gotten worse. I'm ready to move out. Yeah. Not bad. I'm out of here. Now, investigators say there are still more suspects being sought. Police officials are expected to give a media briefing sometime this afternoon.